let's boot it up. I know, right? Yeah, you weren't kidding. <laughs> okay, let's see what this baby can do. Whoa. All right, come on over. Let's give you something to shoot at. Bang, bang. They're all yours, Sergeant. Great. Targeting and ballistics look normal. Let's get you oriented. Bring up your compass. Next one's just east of you. Okay, let's try bearings. Next one's at, uh, 220. All right, not bad. Moving along. Uh, here we go. Sergeant, if you'd be so kind. So, um, looks like it wants you to run from marker to marker as fast as you can. Oh, that's what it wants, huh? Great. Yeah, it says here that uh, it'll spawn targets at each marker. You'll need to drop them before you can proceed. Well, whenever you're ready. Say again. Negative. Uh, yes, this is Staff Sergeant Adams. Send it. Hold on. You know what? Go bother someone else. Out. Hey, F morons. You having fun up there? You know it. safe to say it's working as advertised. You got any more tanks lying around? <laughs> Maybe next time. All right, let's shut it down. The greenbacks are gonna get here soon. sit up here. Copy. American, respond. Over. I'm sorry. I thought I told you to go bother someone else. You know, I don't get annoyed easily. Yeah, right. But this guy, this guy's a special kind of That should do it. Copy. All right, everyone, gather around. See some targets? Really? Sorry, they're all we've got on hand. All right. 
First things first. I'm Staff Sergeant Adams. This is Sergeant Conway. We'll be your cabin crew for today. Cabin crew? Since I'm fairly confident we all know why we're here, I'll skip the usual brief. So, over to you, Sergeant. When you're ready, put some rounds down range. You'll notice that the system took a knee before fire, which creates a more stable firing position. Try to do this as much as possible. If he'd remained standing, he'd have had a tougher time compensating for recoil. It's not impossible, but it's also not ideal. Going prone offers the best stationary shooting posture, with the least recoil and smallest profile. However, be careful of grass and other obstacles obstructing your view. Engaging targets at greater distances is a bit more complicated. Collimator sights, like the sergeant here is using, are not well suited to the task. Sergeant, go ahead and grab the RCO from the crate. From now on, I'll be giving directions to the sergeant exclusively in compass bearings, so please pay attention. I'll call out Conway. It's over there, in the ruined building. You're making me look bad. 100 meters, bearing 290. Remember, control your breathing. Aim for clean, focused shots. 400 meters, bearing 307. Come on, Sergeant, it's right there! On top of the empty gas tank! Great, let's move on. While we're on the subject, you're going to find it much harder to control your breathing on the battlefield. Sergeant... Don't I'm... even say it. Your adoring public awaits. God damn it. the sergeant doing, I hear you ask? Well, in all honesty, I have no idea. Although I think we can all agree it's quite a sight to behold. Fuck you, Staff Sergeant. However, his completely spontaneous and totally unplanned marathon conveniently brings us to our next lesson. Fatigue. It can and it will be your worst nightmare in the field, should you fail to regulate it effectively. Push yourself too hard and you'll find yourself unable to hit shit, even when the situation requires otherwise. And hell, if that's not enough for you, you'll just grow to hate the sound of your own wheezing. The floor is all yours, Sergeant. See? Now the Sergeant has to battle himself as he fires. You need to control your stamina. If you don't, you'll have a hard time hitting anything at all. That'll do, Sergeant. That'll do. American, please, I need to speak with you. There has been an incident. Over. 